In previous videos, we looked at different ways to select interesting, relevant concepts in large concept letters. Uh, but there are other approaches uh, to making uh, diagrams better readable. I'll very briefly mention one of them, nested line diagrams. So here the idea is that we split the attribute set into two or maybe three or four parts. And sometimes it's quite natural to split the attribute set into several parts. Then we compute the concept lattice for each resulting subcontext individually. So we get two lattices. And then we put one lattice inside each node of the other lattice. We get something like this. So here, uh, we have we, we have split attributes into two parts. Those related to education. So you may have uh, uh, at least high school education or at least college education or at least incomplete higher education or at least higher education. So we have four gradations of education. Um, so the concept lattice corresponding to these four attributes is just a straight line. Because if your level of education is, uh, say, at least incomplete higher education, then it's certainly at least high school. So to enter university, you had to finish high school. And then we also have attributes related to employment. Employed, unemployed. And if a person is employed, that he or she can be employed in commerce, in construction, in education, in medicine, in industry. And if it's, if a person is unemployed, he or she may be a pensioner, a student, or a housewife. And so the outer lattice is the lattice corresponding to these employment related attributes. Now we put the education lattice, the diagram of the education lattice inside every node of the diagram of the employment lattice. So we get the nested line diagram. Uh, but we mark only we re we represent only some of the inner lattice nodes with a solid uh, with solid circles, and these are those that correspond to attribute combinations that are realized among objects that fall under the outer concept. Well, more precisely, um, if we have a concept A B. Uh, represented by a solid circle inside the concept CD of an outer lattice, then this corresponds to the global concept A intersection C, B union D. And this is how we can represent all concepts. Inside the outer node corresponding to pensioner, we have two solid circles. One corresponds to pensioners with uh, college education and the other corresponds to pensioners with uh, higher education. If we look at the uh, concept of uh, people working in education, we can see only one solid node there, the bottom one. And this means that all people working in education, their own education is higher education. So their own level of education is higher education. So here the principle is that we can split the representation into several levels and consider each level individually. 